guys, so today I decided I would bring you along on the amazing adventure of growing a hedgehog. So I was in Brainerd last weekend and I was going through the toy store and I found this guy and I had to buy it and I thought what better thing to make a video about than growing a crystal hedgehog. Also, look how cute. It's probably not going to turn out like this, like, at all, but I'm really excited because this is super cute. And I love hedgehogs. When I was purchasing this, I felt the judgment from the lady at the toy store. Now, granted, this was like a kid's toy store, and I was brought in by a stuffed narwhal, but I didn't need the judgment, so, yeah, this is a little bit like what it was like for me. Oh, how cute. Is this for a younger sibling? Oh, actually, it's just for me. Oh. I see. Yeah, I just really like hedgehogs. Yeah, so that was a fun experience. Uh, I could feel her judgment, and it was not appreciated. But she was a super nice, sweet little old lady. And granted, I was in a kid's store. But... Even if I was in a kid's store, this is for 8+. plus. I am plus, so it's okay. But yeah, so I thought we would make a crystal hedgehog together. So, here in the kitchen now because I have to boil some water for this little guy. But, let's start growing a hedgehog. Instructions. Do we need this? Yeah, we want this to turn out as fast as possible. Ooh, we even got pictures. Okay. So, it comes with a bunch of stuff. Okay, so I believe that's what, this is what you grow it in. If I'm not mistaken. Is this the hedgehog? Whoa. <laughs> it's like, oh, look how cute it is. I feel like this is like a science with Abby. I call it that. Science with Abby. feels weird. Oh, I bet it's like crystal stuff. Okay, not gonna touch that just in case. Okay, stirring stick. Okay, crystal powder. Avoid contact with skin and eyes. What the fuck? Is this like intense? This is for eight plus and literally cannot touch your skin. That's terrifying. Step one, pour both packs of chemical powder into the glowing container. Glowing container. Dangerous chemical. I feel like I should have like goggles and like a scientist jacket on. That would be cool. Maybe for future science with Abby's, I'll have to get that. Okay, so it says crystal powder. This is not crystal powder, these are crystal chunks. Okay. Boiling water. Oh, okay. I gotta boil some water. Hold, please. So the problem with this is, is that it literally shows in a tea kettle. I don't have a tea kettle. So that's fun. So basically, we've changed locations because um, it said not to grow the crystals where like food is kept, and this seat on our dining room table no one eats at. So I figured, why not grow it there? So the water is boiling, but I thought I'd update you so it wasn't just suddenly like, boom, new spot. But yeah, so the water's almost done boiling, and then I'll pour it in here, and then we have to let it cool. Yeah. So we'll see how that goes. This is fun. I love science things. I went to a STEM school when I was in elementary school, and I just love science things. Maybe I'll make it a new, like, video segment, Science with Abby. This will be the first one. I have literally been starting for a good like 15 minutes and so I'm calling it quits on that and it's still it's just it's not dissolving no matter what I do so I'm gonna close the lid on that and let it cool for a bit it's already crystals foaming on this popsicle stick so like 
Fingers crossed that means that I'm gonna get a, a crystal hedgehog. So it's finally cold enough so I can place this in. <laughs> just have to literally leave this still for 24 hours. He's in his little pink prison. So it's been almost 24 hours. Got another hour and a half to go. But it is actually working and I am so happy about this because I think that this is actually maybe gonna work. But like it looks super cool. I'm just worried when I grab it out, it's gonna all sh break, you know? So hopefully it's kind of sturdy. But it's kind of working. It's kind of working. Okay, so we're back. And it's been over 24 hours because I let it sit for a little longer because I was super sleepy last night. So hopefully it works. But I have to put on some gloves because it said not to get the chemicals on your skin. And I don't really want to die. Okay, here we go. Like not coming out. Oh my goodness gracious, how am I supposed to get this out? that are on it. Oh my God. <gasps> it actually worked. I have a crystal hedgehog. Okay, this is exciting. So now I have to let it dry for a day and then I can put him anywhere. Guess what? We have a crystal hedgehog! It's adorable and it actually worked, which I'm shocked about because I thought for sure that this was not going to work. So, But it's a little hedgehog, it's so cute and it's heavy. But yeah, we got some cute crystals! I'm super excited that I now have a crystal hedgehog. So this little guy needs a name. So I was thinking like Peter Poker or Peter Quill, but you guys let me know down in the comments what you prefer or if you have any other names that we should name. And in the next video or so, I'll announce the name of this little guy. So leave a comment down below with that. Give it a like if you like this video and if you want to see more like fun science experiments. And don't forget to subscribe. Ring that little notification bell and you'll get updates from me whenever I upload. I'll see you guys next Sunday. Bye. <laughs>